the West Virginia Capitol as Governor Justice signed four bills into law. Thanks for joining us for 7 News at 6. I'm Catherine Guyon. And I'm Steve Moore. The governor received the most applause for a bill that gives every state employee a $2,500 raise, even though some of that is going to be lost to PEIA, PEIA health insurance premium increases, which he also signed. And on this St. Patrick's Day, the governor also signed a trade agreement between West Virginia and the nation of Ireland. The ink is also now dry on the state's $4.8 billion budget. Governor Justice says the biggest bill was the one that cuts everyone's personal income taxes by 21% this year. What's that going to do? I mean, first of all, it sends a message to the outside world that, you know, you come to West Virginia, it's a great place to live. We're on a pathway of reducing our income tax. We're on a pathway, you know, of doing other things in, in regard to taxes. But there are critics. The state's labor unions say the PEIA increase will wipe out most of the pay increase. They and many Democrats in the legislature were opposed. A spokesperson with WVU Medicine issued a statement on the PEIA bill, which says, quote, We are grateful to Governor Justice and the West Virginia legislature for stabilizing and improving PEIA. Because of their work, Wheeling Hospital will be able to continue participating with PEIA. Stay with 7 News for updates.